good morning and welcome to day six um, at Golden Bay where we've travelled um, actually down the west coast um, to the Cuyahoga Lakes and um, we've just made it about, it's about a half an hour trip by car. This isn't our final destination, um, there's about a 15 minute walk up a track to another section of the lake, so we're going to do that uh, and I'll take some photos there, uh, maybe do some b-roll from, from the Cahoka Lake track and um, yeah, today's a bit of a travel day, uh, going around some lakes, um, we're going to see how far we can get um, traveling west. Um, but we're here at Kyoga Lakes, so we'll um, have a look around and see if there's some photo ops here. Well, here we are at the second of the lakes, Lake Lake Kahika Lakes, uh, Lake Number Two. It took us, yeah, it took us about ten minutes uh, to walk here. A fairly easy walk, um, and we've come to this gorgeous open lake, um, beautiful clear blue water, and uh, quite warm apparently, according to Tim. Tim is just there, waiting across the other side. Um, to check that out and yeah it's it's a lovely little area it's probably not particularly photogenic at this time of the day as you can see with the light uh, it's quite bright um, but yeah a lovely place to visit um, if you're coming to Golden Bay um Good afternoon everybody, um, we have driven for a couple of hours along some pretty windy dirt roads and we have made it to this gorgeous beach uh, that you see behind me. It's, uh, we think, we think it's called the Anatothi River, Anatothi Beach, but I'm um, could be wrong we've just driven for a couple of hours and um, along the west coast and come to this gorgeous secluded spot although when I say secluded there are uh, some batches up there up there um, and some people we've passed who are here for a swim uh, it's fairly sandy beach. The water looks to be quite calm and inviting although I haven't bought my togs which is possibly a good thing. Um, so we'll have a little bit of an explore here at the beach. Um, you know it's middle of the afternoon on a very bright hot sunny day so probably not a huge 
uh, help for photography, but um, yeah, we'll have a little wander, have a little look and see if we can grab a few record shots of this gorgeous beach. spot and what an idyllic part of the world this is you know I know I'm lucky enough to live in New Zealand and most of my blogs are about going around the west coast of the South Island where I live and I don't get much of a chance to go further afield than that my wife and I I think as I mentioned in the uh, what's in my bag blog which is part of this series. We don't go on holiday very often. Um, so this is just amazing. It's been an incredible experience. We've still got another four days, four or five days to go. But this is just a beautiful, idyllic part of New Zealand. And if, if you're ever lucky enough to come to New Zealand, make sure you check out Golden Bay um, we've been blessed with incredible weather and it looks like it's going to continue for the next four or five days and it is just a gorgeous gorgeous part of New Zealand so if you're lucky enough to be able to head over to see us here in New Zealand then make sure you come to the Golden Bay area it's well worth it it really is an incredible part of the country and I hope that these vlogs have gone some way to showcase that. Um, I haven't vlogged all of it, just some of my time here but man it's been an amazing trip and so worthwhile. Thank you. 